Okay, so what we've just looked at is how data is represented in charts. So we went through an example together with bar charts and we briefly looked at a pie chart, but data can also be represented in tables. So we're going to go through this example together and we've got given a table here with the reasons why people attend university. So our reasons or our variables are given on the left hand side of the table underneath the title here reasons and then the percentage of people is given on the right hand side so all down here okay so we've got as our reasons to get a degree in the subject you love and eight percent of people chose that they didn't know what else to do with their life and 15 percent of people chose that one to party, which was 44%, so that's quite high. To be honest, I probably would have picked that one, um, you know, in hindsight. So another one is they can't wait to get away from their parents, which is 11%, and to get a student loan, good reason, um, but 22%. So we're gonna answer the questions below. So according to our data, what is the main reason that people attend university? So we can't visually look at a chart now and see which bar is the highest or see which area of the pie chart is the biggest. So we need to look at just the numbers this time. So if we have a look again on the right hand side, we can see all of the percentages and we should all recognize that 44 is the biggest number there. So it's the biggest percentage. So what that means is most people chose the option to party. So the main reason why people attended university we can put here is to party. And to be honest, I would have probably picked that answer as well. However, obviously in final year now, I'm much more motivated. <laughs> and then the next question says, what percent of people came to university to get away from their parents? So if we have a look down where the reasons column is and we go to can't wait to get away from your parent, 11% of people chose that. It's asking to give it as a percentage. So we're literally just going to copy what the table says and put 11%. So I hope that makes sense. Um, you guys can now have a go at answering the three other table questions. So it's got the same style um, and yeah, good luck. <laughs>